decades, wind and solar have been the centerpieces of green energy. But the ocean's ever-constant waves and tides are also rich with renewable power that has remained largely untapped. 在苏格兰海岸附近，这个外观有如船舰的大型装置是世界最大的潮汐能设备。Its jumbo jet-sized floating platform called the O2 has two giant rotors that sit 60 feet below the surface of the water and can harness the energy of the ocean's tides. It's kinetic energy, so the bits of technology that generate the power look not too different to a wind turbine. 不像风力涡轮机从四面八方收集风力发电 ，O2 潮汐能设备仰赖涨退潮两股能量，但比起风力，潮汐更加可靠。You have a flood tide when the tide comes in, and you have an ebb tide when the tide goes out. You can predict those motions years and decades into advance. 苏格兰之间海洋电力公司从二零一九年开始打造 O2 设备，左右两组涡轮机各搭载长达十公尺长的叶片，能够三百六十度旋转，迎合不同方向的水流。今年四月，在苏格兰北方的奥克尼群岛，欧洲海洋能源中心展开一系列调整测试，如今已经透过海底电缆连接到陆上电网，为两千户英国家庭供电。We just want to do as much as we can to help turn the tide on climate change. It's that simple. 英国四面环海，潮汐能可说是唾手可得的资源，但目前海上能源开发以固定式离岸风电为主，潮汐能距离大规模商业化还要一段时间。镜头转到美国纽约，这里也在发展潮汐能。In the U.S., Verdant Power's Tri-Frame system operates at the bottom of the East River, which is actually a tidal strait. It's in a pre-commercial phase, but actively delivers power to New York City's electric grid. The potential for marine energy、uh, is something like 250 gigawatts around the world, and that's just tidal. It doesn't include rivers or large canals. So you can see the potential for the applications, not only our technology, but our competitors as well. I mean, there's lots of room, and we really hope our competitors succeed too, for the sake of the industry. But we've got to get our cost down. 发展潮汐能最大的障碍就是成本太高，从建造、营运到维护都需要大量资金，进入门槛不低。只要是有政府挹注投资，就有机会驱使成本降低。In the UK, there are economic incentives. We're counting on those for our first commercial projects. As we start mass producing the technology, we're going to pivot from the UK and right back to North America, Alaska, New York, Canada. Tremendous water currents everywhere to harvest. Climate change isn't going to be cracked by one solution. If you add them all together, you start making a big difference. That's what we need. 相较于太阳能与风力发电等间歇性再生能源，海水潮落有周期性，制造厂商与开发商相对容易评估设备发电量。专家将潮汐能和二十年前的风力相比，随着技术设备日新月异，预测潮汐能的普及只是时间问题。t v b s 新闻综合报道。请支持专门报道国际新闻的全新 YouTube 频道 TVBS 国际 Plus， 扩大视野，掌握趋势。邀请您订阅，并且开启通知小铃铛。